quick note before we keep moving on. When we, I talked about effort at the beginning, right? You control your effort. Don't mistake effort for speed. Right? Just because you do a drill fast doesn't mean it's a great effort. Right? Your effort is, you're paying attention to detail. Your effort is, are you really feeling the position? Right? Anybody can let a guy in, pop the hips, throw the head down, sir. It's not realistic. Right? Make it realistic right now. You really got to feel what it's like to have a guy on your leg that's like a dog on a bone. Right? He, he's not going to let go. He's not going to let go. It's a fight. It's a war in there. Right? So I got to make sure that I'm continuing to pressure him and pressure and pressure and pressure until he makes a mistake, until he breaks where I force him into a bad position. Okay? One other, li another little point to this, and we're going to go out and we're going to spar a little bit. But when he gets in on this high crotch, some of you guys, just a little bit, you're, you're pushing down on his head like this. Right? The other thing is some of you guys are you're cross facing first. Guys, if I cross face him, I'm putting him in better position. Okay? If I cross face from my feet, I'm putting him in better position because he's just going to drive up into me. Right now I'm not in a good spot. So when I say locate the head, it's I'm turning my body here. I'm right on the bottom of his head, right in his neck. Right, right where they meet. Right here. Now I'm stuffing and I'm, and I'm starting to get that leg back. Right? I'm stuffing, I'm stuffing, I'm stuffing. He builds. Boom, pop, boom, like that. Like, still let him that. Now it's down. And I swear I'm coming off the shoulder. Now, here's a big part. Some of you guys are turning the corner. And as soon as you break his hands, you're going like this. You're coming around. You're going to do all that work, all the hard part, and then on the go behind, where you just have to finish. Just finish. We're releasing pressure. Right? I'm wrestling a good guy here, so when I go around like that, I go around the waist, all he's going to do is grab me to the side that I'm on. Okay? So I already have him down. We're already here, and I stop. Oh, time. I'm trying to break his hands. I break his hands. Oh, and I come here. Out. All that work I did for nothing. For nothing because I didn't finish. I didn't finish my effort. I should get in that position. Effort, effort. One of the big things when we're defending our legs, we're moving our feet the whole time. We're moving our feet. Anybody know who Rashid off is? Nobody? Nobody? Who is it? Okay, well, wait. Who did he beat in that tournament from the U.S.? This is the easiest question I asked. Stever. He beat Stever. Okay? So, you know what he did? Your rope says, rope loves you, man. He loves you. So, one of the things that a lot of us, a lot of people in this country do to folk style, right? One of the things we do is a guy gets to our legs and kind of we get complacent when we get him extended. We get complacent when we think we stop them. But then we leave our legs behind. Okay? What I mean by that is this. He gets in on a single this time, right? He's in on a single leg, and I do a great job. Boom, I get my leg back, I get my leg back, and he gets, I might even break his hands. I break his hands here, and then we go like this. And then we give my leg back again. We give it back to him. Right? Why do we give it back to him? Because some of you guys love going here. You love going to the Shin Wizard. What do you think the percentages are that I finish, that I score here? That I score? 50? That's hot. 20. 30. Right? right? Not a high percentage of me finishing and scoring from here. What's the way you think the bigger percentages are better there, or think the percentages are better here? Yeah. Now, that's not to say don't work on a shin wizard, don't get solid in a shin wizard, but listen, guys, don't put yourself there. Don't put yourself, don't be in a good position and then revert back to a position you already beat. Alright, once I square up, once I'm moving, I keep my feet moving. Alright, same thing on my high cross, he goes high cross. I'm not standing, I'm moving, I'm moving, I'm moving, I'm moving. Oh, he goes, I'm down, I'm moving, I'm moving, I'm moving, I'm moving. I'm moving. I'm moving. Oh, I make my score. Feet never stop. Feet never stop moving. Alright? Pressure, pressure, feet moving, feet are moving. Alright? So right now we're gonna go. We're just gonna go, I'm gonna give you two minutes. Trade off once for a little spar. Once he gets into your leg, it's a spar. Right? It's about 40% or so. I just give him a different feel. Maybe try to come out the back. Maybe try to turn the corner. Maybe try to snake the leg. Give him a different feel. Defensive man. Stay honest. Stay honest. Good effort. Stick to the detail. All right, two minutes. Let's go. One, two.